Titans because now the Reds are at home uh, against the Nationals with Ashcraft going. Uh, these starters don't have great numbers, certainly, but um, Ashcraft still going to be a big favorite here against the Nats, certainly. Uh, set a dollar ninety, but I'm showing it going down now. Maybe even to a dollar eighty, dollar seventy-five might be uh, like the auctioneers. Mindy, you were at Hamilton, and uh, the other sports is on. I don't know if anybody watched the Ocho yesterday uh, on ESPN two, where they showed all the uh, crazy sports, twenty-four hours of crazy sports, and it looks like the old days of ESPN before they had. <laughs> pro sports and college sports. And one of the uh, uh, events was the Wisconsin Auctioneers Championship, where they just what? had the best guys. Who the thing, guys huh? blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Here's the Reds, a dollar ninety-nine, now the $1.75. Oh, well, I kind of feel like in honor of uh, Hamilton, I got to go with the Washington Nationals today, oh, right? <laughs> uh, that's what I'm going to do. I, I, I kind of feel like it's a, you know, um, I kind of feel like maybe I shouldn't do it. How about that? Uh, <laughs> but I, my numbers here have the Nationals today. I'll take them on the run line. I know Corbin hasn't been great. I think it might be a pretty good spot for him. I think you're catching the Reds at a time. They just got swept by the Cubs pretty bad. Uh, I think it's just this little bit of spot here. Uh, the Nationals here are still putting up 4.58 runs per game. The Reds are allowing the 5.3 runs per game here right now. Uh, Nationals also have the way better bullpen, 3.77 ERA to 4.63. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, take the Nationals here on the run line. Yeah, the little concern about for me with the Reds here, actually, uh, was seeing what happened there in that Cubs with all those runs is certainly of concern uh, right now. Let's see what's up with the chat in this one. I would know that. You know, the Reds are in a, in a fight. And we have, uh, oh, gosh. Oh, Lex Steele, hello. Good nice morning. Ron, first five on the Reds, and here's Prince Moore. It says Reds running line, JD on the under, solo. <laughs> Scotch. <laughs> Nats here, money line. Uh, yeah, money line's like 170 or so. Big plus money. Which is money? Say it again. Oh, I said uh, he likes the Nats money line. I said that's big plus money. Oh, like yeah, yeah. Well, it looks like the yeah, it looks like the move is actually a little bit on the on the Nats here. Maybe the Reds back at home will start to feel it a little bit. Scotch likes Washington on the run line. I'm gonna I'm gonna take it with you. Uh, you know, I don't mind Corbin. Um, Good. Give me Good. some, you know, look, uh, surprise, he's still on Washington, actually. I, I don't know his contract situation. I don't know. But to me, he'd be the type of, you know, like his numbers aren't great. But maybe if you, you know, he still competes out there. Look, everybody makes fun of this guy. Uh, you certainly could do worse than some of these pitchers are throwing out there on some of the contending teams that could use a good veteran like that. But nonetheless, he's still there. Renoir. Clarity. Uh, guys like well I, I thought that was a you know pretty good uh i thought that was a pretty good move actually and i thought that's a, a blue look you had the under in that game yesterday with uh flaherty and uh, uh gosman mindy uh, i know you you know talked about the blue jays on the show and i kind of uh, balked at that a little bit but uh, uh flaherty i think that i think they're gonna benefit there orioles Here's under from Bionic. Charles maybe going over though. Wow, was it that bad for Ashcraft there? <laughs> I think he likes the under. That's the way I was thinking though. I I, I yeah, feel I like, like an under. It's hard to go under in Cincinnati games, but it is a ten and a half here. All right, Lex, good job. Uh, Jacoby over, over, over. No way, you know, no agreement here on the chat with the total. You know, no chance. Nats money line for Tucker. Jimmy looks like he likes the Nats and the under. So let's take the Nats, Mindy. Um, look, they're not great, but uh, the Reds, I'm a little concerned uh, for the Reds moving forward. 
uh, here. As I said, as I said, you yes. Said that yeah. at the beginning of that uh, Cubs game, I didn't quite, you know, Cubs series, I didn't quite believe it, but kind of looking that way. Yeah, right. The Reds got that right. Reds started off good. Uh, Ashcraft has been much better of late. Just to, uh, you know, I see you guys making fun of him. He has a 2.08 ERA in his last three starts, won two of those games. So, yeah, they gave up 41 runs in those, basically, in those three losses after that first win. So, Corbin has a 6.75 ERA in his last three starts. But the Nats are 8-8 eight and eight in his starts, which, you know, that's just 500. But considering his numbers, uh, seems like he gets some run support. So against Ashcraft, who obviously not comfortable in the small park, um, we'll take the Nats. Feels like there'll be some volatility in this one. <laughs> right. 